Investors have the ability to create allocation goals and custom benchmarks to use throughout Portfolio Analyst to analyze portfolio performance. To do so, the investor selects the Configuration button located at the top right of the Portfolio Analyst homepage. The right side of the screen will display boxes for allocation goals and custom benchmarks. The Portfolio Analyst Allocation Goals feature allows investors to view their current versus target asset and sub-asset class allocations for seamless portfolio rebalancing. Once goals are configured, the investor can run the Allocation Goals report to identify over- and underweighted asset and sub-asset classes versus the configured goal. In addition to the Allocation Goals report, investors can view actual weightings compared to their goal weightings through the planning widget on the Portfolio Analyst dashboard. To create an Allocation Goal, investors can select the plus button. The investor then enters a goal name and, from the drop-down, can choose to configure the report by Asset Class or Sub-Asset Class. There are seven asset classes to choose from. Cash, Commodities, Equities, Fixed Income, Real Estate, Other Assets, and Liabilities. Sub-asset classes will be broken down by the seven asset classes with the option to fill in a total of 33 subcategories. Investors can choose to set their goal either by percentage or dollar amount. If using percentage, please note that goals must total to 100%. Investors will enter their desired allocation amount in the various asset classes at the bottom of the page. Once filled in with the investor's desired amount, they can select Continue, review the allocation goal, and select Continue again to save. The allocation goal can now be seen on the configuration page and is available to use in both custom reports and the planning widget. From the configuration page, the investor can use the eye icon to view the details of the allocation goal, the pencil icon to edit the allocation goal, and the X icon to delete the allocation goal. For more information on running Portfolio Analyst reports or using widgets, please see the Portfolio Analyst reports video as well as the Portfolio Analyst widgets video. Next, we'll take a look at custom benchmarks. Portfolio Analyst provides a large number of standard industry benchmarks for investors to choose from. However, custom benchmarks will allow the investor to combine multiple existing standard benchmarks. Investors can then compare their portfolio performance to the custom benchmark. To create a custom benchmark, investors can select the plus button. The investor then enters a name and an abbreviation for the benchmark. The abbreviation can be used as a quick way to search for and find this custom benchmark when adding it to a custom report. In the benchmark section, the investor can scroll through the choices by clicking on the arrows in the bottom right corner. Choose how many results they would like displayed on a page and use the search bar to type the benchmark they wish to include in their custom benchmark. For example, to search for funds and ETFs related to the S&P 500 index, the investor can type S&P 500 into the search bar and a list of benchmarks containing those characters will appear. Investors can select the checkbox next to any benchmarks they wish to add and enter the weightings of each benchmark added. The investor must include at least two standard benchmarks when creating a custom benchmark but can add any number of standard benchmarks to their custom benchmark as long as the total weight equals 100%. In this example, the investor has added the S&P 500 as well as the Russell 2000 index and would like both to be of equal weight, so they type 50 for each benchmark to make sure the total adds up to 100%. The investor then selects Continue at the bottom and is taken to the Review screen. Once the investor is ready to save the custom benchmark, they click Save Changes. The custom benchmark can now be seen on the configuration page and is available for use in custom reports. 
from the configuration page, the investor can use the I icon to view the details of the custom benchmark, the pencil icon to edit the custom benchmark, and the X icon to delete the custom benchmark. The custom benchmark can be added to custom reports through the Reports tab by searching for the custom benchmark in the Benchmark section. For more information regarding configuring allocation goals or using custom benchmarks, please see our User Guide.